Hi folks, Pussy Power here. So, um, hi again and I hope you've been well. I don't know uh, how you feel about current season here in England. It's a proper autumn and you see all the um, yellowish, reddish, brownish leaves falling down and it makes you think about how you have to let go the previous season of summer and slowly welcome winter. And that reminds me that I have to face the biggest issue, like uh, with this transition, how to adapt myself. And I'm sure all of you struggle with the same thing because adaptation is the clue and not uh, it's not always that smooth as we imagine that and the cycle of life. And unless you are not um, um, <laughs> from a plastic thing, you are alive, you have to approach changes. So. I just had a really nice chat with my sister and we went through uh, self-development exercises uh, in order to remind ourselves why we're doing what we're doing and what we want to improve, where we want to go and what is happening, what we are not happy about and dig deeper inside us and uh, bring out the fears and see them like, ah, oh, this is what was bothering me, this is what I was afraid of and now find a solution. So. Yes, everyone says if you want to bring success in your life, you have to focus on solutions. But before solutions, you have to identify the issues well. So I did that and obviously um, it's a work in progress, so nothing is done completely yet. But the thing is I always struggle with um, money and so on. and. She always struggled with relationships. I have great relationships. I love, I uh, embrace people as they are and don't expect much. And you know, it's as it is and I love them and I feel loved and I never had a problem. And uh, she has opposite issues. She has like, she thinks there's too much pressure on her and too many expectation on her that freaks her out and she doesn't want to and she rather argue and uh, you know, being naughty in order to uh, prove them wrong but do opposite even she doesn't believe that and sometimes she regrets her words but they tell her something and she knows that what she's saying is not right but she does it anyway just because she wants to piss them off to let her be because of their expectations I said to her you have to let this mindset go um, but I understand we all been there uh, in certain points of our life I believe you know then message me I would like to know your story uh, and she said that it's painful for her. She always rises her ex expectations high from herself and she disappoints, so she rather doesn't try. She already knows this is gonna end up badly, so she's not gonna even try. Even she wants, but no, because then she tells it to other people and they have higher expectation on her and then there is disappointment because it's not immediate success, right? It's a work in progress as well. And I'm struggling with the same thing. Uh, people put on me like, oh, you are clever, you're doing things and all that, you are... I, yeah, I have my lazy moments, but if I compare myself to majority of people I know, um, my laziness is on 5% and their laziness is about 55. Um, so I feel I'm quite active, but I'm still not where I wanna be and what I'm doing wrong. Maybe I'm paying attention to wrong things and so on. How to build up my empire I always dream about you know because my relationships are important and I know that I'm supposed to surround myself with more successful people and so on and I know I have very positive people around me um, I could have even more that's true it's an endless uh, and I'm trying to dismiss uh, the negative people but then I realized I met my other friend and um, he is quite successful, he is an uh, entrepreneur, he travels a lot, he um, knowing more cultures and so on and uh, he's doing well and he always seems to be happy and he knows it all and all that thing and I'm like, yeah, but I'll tell him my, something you're doing wrong, something you do, yeah, but I'm doing my best, maybe I'm not where I want to be, but I'm going there slowly. No, you are there where I, where I met you like a few months ago or five months ago. No much progress. I'm like, yeah, thank you. Um, I mean, I hear it from everywhere. I would like to see more results, but uh, 
it's just not happening as I planned but I see something is changing and new things happen and I feel good about certain things I'm writing more I'm um, you know uh, working more towards self-development learning new skills uh, new information about um, how to have passive income or uh, how to be um, financially independent and I have uh, quite a few jobs <laughs> to support myself sometimes I'm so annoyed by people that I just don't go anywhere and I lock myself I call I, I cannot because there have been too many people and I had no time to digest it so the whole social system is like oh boom 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 and you have no time for you know self discovery or other things so if you are a shift worker or you have like a permanent job from 9 to 5 or you are on the regular um, rat race then you know you're never gonna really make it because you have to think out of I'm not saying I'm doing it right I'm just this works for me when I listen my body tells me no I just cannot handle this much uh, my mind is like I'm sorry I would ruin my uh, performance at work if I do it right now so please give me space and but no one no boss understands that right so you have to invent a lie so you are basically forced to lie anyway so this is my struggle uh, in order to adapt to, to Sorry for the noise, there is a high road um, opposite. But uh, it's about being patient and persistent. And this is what I told her with her relationship issues and with my material issues, is that uh, we are not patient and we want immediate results. But it's never gonna happen like that. And if you are lucky and you win, I don't know, lottery, then it's installed result but then you have to deal with the consequences so how are you gonna invest the money where you're gonna spend them or where you're gonna put them or uh, so on you know so you can lose it same quickly as you earn it earn that um, or gain that because lottery is not really earning um, but anyway you can use it wisely or stupidly it's up to you so I try this to do my best I know I can do more and more and uh, some people say me oh well, you're doing wonderful things I mean I'm impressed you're doing much things than other people I said yes but I'm still not where I want to be so when they ask me I put myself down I realize I'm warning myself that no it's not good and blah 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 I'm putting myself down so I realize there are much worse people than me and they are always so positive I'm doing well I did so much and then I'm like what is it actually what you're doing and they did not do much it just they sound like they do <laughs> you know and I'm like that's pretty impressive so you can have a good job for less effort mm, good so same thing with my sister uh, she is on a point when she deals with her because she's younger she's 19 so she's home and parents are still there and she's craving independence and so on but she's not there yet because she's still studying in high school and all that but she feels like she, it's time her to go to explore the world to find a thing because now she's told me she realized she clings on material side of it and she doesn't feel like she can fully express herself who she is but she doesn't know who she is yet she's still discovering herself like all of us it's like a lifelong journey <laughs> yeah so I'm discovering my pussy power and pussy power of others and uh, it's pretty impressive what you can find out there yeah so uh, this is it uh, Generally, I just wanted to uh, come back to video making and remind you that I exist and you exist because you are obviously listening to this and accept the change in order to learn something new, do something new towards your progress, ask yourself new questions or repeat yourself question that you forgot you have to ask yourself in order to grow emotionally or um, materially or even like with your um, physical uh, goals like if you want to be fitter and so on yes so have a wonderful season of November <laughs> and uh, I will come back to you soon with more specific uh, results of my work towards my success and hopefully it will help you on your journey to be inspired and Cross those information and bring the best out of it for yourself. So, hold your pussy bow, let it grow. <laughs>